An astute class submarine has been pictured with HMS Queen Elizabeth at sea for the first time. The interaction happened while operating in the Mediterranean. While the British Ministry of Defense didn't name the boat assigned, it's likely that the vessel was the HMS Artful, third astute class boat. The carrier and the submarine are deployed as part of Carrier Strike Group 21. This event marks the meeting of two of Britain's most formidable naval assets. In this video, Defense Updates analyzes how potent is Britain's duo, Queen Elizabeth class carrier and astute class submarine. Let's get started. This video is sponsored by the free to play online military themed strategy game Conflict of Nations, which is played by millions of players worldwide. We talk a lot about military power and tactical plans of different nations on this channel, but what about trying them out for yourself? Conflict of Nations is set in the late 20th and early 21st century, fielding present day and highly modern battlefield technology. At the core of the game is an exciting real time combat system, placing players in control of an existing nation of this world and its army pitting them against other gamers in a struggle for world domination. Units are moved across the map in real time, often taking hours to fulfill their assigned mission goals, allowing for a very deep level of strategic planning and integrated tactical execution. Forming lasting alliances or short-lived coalitions is an essential part of the modern military environment. Hence, Conflict of Nations allows players to form cooperative plans and teams in an all-out effort to conquer set objectives through the combined force of arms. Conflict of Nations can be played in PC or mobile. So why wait? Register yourself using the link in the description below and get 13,000 gold reward along with one month Security Council membership. The Queen Elizabeth class is a class of two aircraft carriers of the United Kingdom's Royal Navy. HMS Queen Elizabeth, the lead ship of this class, has been commissioned in 2017. The second, HMS Prince of Wales, was commissioned in 2019. Each will display 65,000 tons and has a length of 280 meters. They will carry around 1,600 personnel on board. They are the largest warships ever constructed for the Royal Navy and the second largest non-US Navy warships after the Yamato class battleships. The cost of the program is 6.2 billion pounds. Engine configuration of Queen Elizabeth class is as follows. Two Rolls-Royce Marine Trent MT-30, 36 megawatt, 48,000 horsepower gas turbine engines. Four Wartzilla 38, 11.6 megawatt, 15,600 horsepower marine diesel engines. It has a speed of around 26 knots or 48 kilometers per hour and a range of 10,000 nautical miles or 18,520 kilometers. The ship's radars include BAE systems and THALES jointly produced S1850M for long range wide area search. The BAE Systems Artisan 3D Type 997 Maritime Medium Range Active Electronically Scanned Array Radar and Navigation Radar. BAE claims the S1850M has fully automatic detection and track initiation that can track up to 1,000 air targets at a range of around 400 kilometers or 250 miles. For self-defense, the carrier has Phalanx CIWS, 30mm DS-30M Mark II guns and miniguns. HMS Queen Elizabeth will generally carry 24 F-35B fighters as well as 14 Merlin anti-submarine and utility helicopters, but in wartime the carrier could carry up to 36 fighters. The F-35 is a family of single-seat single-engine, all-weather, stealth, multi-role fighters. The fifth-generation combat aircraft is designed to perform ground attack and air superiority missions. The F-35B, which is a short takeoff and vertical landing Stovall variant, is the first to combine radar evading stealth technology with supersonic speeds and the ability to work with carriers. 
British F-35Bs will be armed with several weapons like Meteor, ASRAM, Paveway 4, Spear 3, to name a few. The Astute class is the largest class of nuclear-powered fleet submarines SSNs, in service with the Royal Navy. The class sets a new standard for the Royal Navy in terms of weapons load, communication facilities, and stealth. Seven boats will be constructed. The first of the class, Astute, was launched in 2007, commissioned in 2010, and declared fully operational in May of 2014. The Astute class is the largest and most advanced attack submarines ever built for the Royal Navy. Vessels of this class have a length of 97 meters and displaces 7,400 tons. The boats of the Astute class are powered by a Rolls-Royce PWR2 Core H, a pressurized water reactor, and fitted with a pump jet propulsor. Astute leads the way with many technological firsts and is the quietest ever made. Astute vessels are equipped with Thales Sonar 2076, Atlas DESO 25 Echo Sounder, two Thales CM 010 Optronic Masts, as well as Raytheon successor IFF. HMS Artful has six 21 inch, that's 533 millimeter, torpedo tubes with stowage for up to 38 weapons. The Astute class carries both Tomahawk land attack cruise missiles TLAM, and Spearfish heavyweight torpedoes. The Tomahawk land attack missile is a long-range, all-weather, jet-powered, subsonic cruise missile that's primarily used by the United States Navy, warships, and submarines. The missile has a speed of about 550 miles per hour or 890 kilometers per hour and a maximum range of 2,500 kilometers or 1,550 miles. It's guided by GPS and INS, and some variants also have active radar homing. The Spearfish torpedo is the heavy torpedo used by the submarines of the Royal Navy. It can be guided by wire or by autonomous, active, or passive sonar, and provides both anti-submarine warfare ASW, and anti-surface ship warfare. ASUW capability. Spearfish development began in the 1970s with production starting in 1988 and deployment in 1992. By 2014, they had completely replaced the old Tigerfish torpedo. It's said to be one of the most advanced torpedoes in the world and also the fastest long range torpedo ever produced. It has a 300 kilogram or 660 pound warhead. Maximum speed of 148 kilometers per hour or 92 miles per hour and a range of 54 kilometers or 33 miles A carrier enables power projection well beyond the country's coastline Queen Elizabeth class is an excellent platform and technically second only to American Nimitz and Ford class supercarriers the two carriers will give Britain a lot of reach and operational flexibility, especially since they have F-35Bs. Astute class attack submarines is a key asset for the British Navy as it's not only important for carrier defense but also can be deployed offensively as ship killers and to be used for land attack role. Queen Elizabeth class and Astute class attack submarines form a potent duo that will be problematic for any rival to tackle.